there and putting it into the iron selective electrode. Okay, so it measures sodium, potassium and chloride on this bit of the machine here and then it puts an aliquot into that dilution turntable at the back. It makes a dilution of that sample with saline, uh, 1 in 5 dilution, and then it takes separate aliquots from the dilution turntable and puts those into a sample turntable there. You can see the probe is moving that sample to the sample turntable. It then goes through a quarter of a turn to here where it's putting in the reagents. So we've got a reagent 1 probe which is moving reagent into the actual cuvette where the analysis takes place. After five minutes the sample will be in the right position for the reagent 2 probe to put sample into the uh, cuvette again and it then goes through mixing. So we've got a mixer 1 and a mixer 2 here which come out and vibrate backwards and forwards and spin around very quickly in the cuvette. You can see that now. That ensures that the sample is mixed effectively. And constantly, throughout the time of the 10 minutes that the assay will take, the lamp here has a spectrophotometer on the other side.